Hi, this is Saul from DSI. You're watching to my weekly blog. In the next few videos, I'll start answering your commonly asked questions. For example, how expensive is the MTA1 bioceramic sealer? We all know that bioceramics are the modern generation of the bioactive materials that are used extensively now in the endodontic therapy, slowly replacing the older generation of zinc oxide eugenol and resin based sealers. It is clear that bioceramic materials are better in every single way. They are dimensionally stable, biocompatible, possess antimicrobial properties, and they are hydrophilic. But at the same time, they are considered to be more expensive. How expensive they are? Let's try and find it out. The cost of the MTA1 bioceramic sealer Persa range is only meaningful if we attempt to find out how many physical root canals can be done using its content. So today we will discover how many applications are present in one single syringe. In this video we will review a practical benchtop experiment performed by Dr. Alan Nasser from Real Life Endo Team using the basic condensation technique, which is injecting outside the mouth on the paper pad and transferring the sealer in the root canal using the file and the master gut aperture cone. And this is how it went. They put enough sealer on the paper pad to allow filling of a single canal. After measuring the amount used, they then checked how many times this amount can be extruded from one syringe to determine how many root canals can be done. The answer turned out to be 57 applications. This is the approximate amount of root canals you can obturate with a single 2 gram syringe of bioceramic sealer. And there is important detail. They didn't use the advanced root condensation technique, which involves direct injection of the sealer inside the root canal and requires a microscope for adequate sealer placement and control. The basic technique does not require you to change the dispensing tip between the patients since the tip doesn't come in contact with the patient and the material does not set inside the tip unless not used for several days. The advanced technique is more efficient, requires a microscope but wastes a very small amount of sealer in the dispensing tip because the tip has to be changed between each patient as it comes in contact with the tooth. 